Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say thank you for the support. I really do appreciate it. I'm trying to get 100,000 subscribers, so if you want to help me out, make sure to subscribe. Now enjoy the video. Come in. You're late already. I don't have time to hear your excuses. Sit down. You know exactly why I called you in here. It's because of your test. You basically bawled on it. Most of these answers are not even right. And you usually score higher than this. So I know something is wrong with you. So tell me. What's been bothering you? Well, something's gotta be up. You're usually a, a, a high-grading student around here. There's something bothering you, and I can tell. So, come on. A lot of kids get pretty worried about my tests and whatnot. So, I could see why that you're nervous. But, like I've said before, you're a high-grading student. You've never been nervous about a test before. Why this one specifically? What's going on? Oh. I see what's going on here. So. You were told to fall, to basically fail this test because some kids around here or some idiots came around here and told you that studying really hard is not going to be getting you anywhere in life. You have to train, and that's it. I will see forth to know who these kids are, which I have probably a good guess, but I will see through that these kids get punished for their actions. Not a problem, but with you, I'm not done with you yet. You fell for peer pressure. And also bullying. You gotta stand up for yourself sometimes. I've learned that myself, that standing up for yourself means you're strong and brave. And that's some true energy you need to be a hero. It doesn't matter what those kids said, what those idiots said. In order to be a perfect hero, in order to be, to be a great hero, you must study and train equally. I've learned that the hard way, and look where I am now. Now, I'm not yelling at you. I'm saying it with strict tone of voice. I want you to be better. I want you to be better than some idiot spreading false claims and whatnot about being pro-heroes is just pure training. You need every single subject done. So, do you want to retake the test at a later date, or do you want to retake it now? All right. You're lucky, because I printed it out another piece of paper, just in case you did say yes. So here. I'll be here. I'll be on my break as of right now. You just sit here and do your test. Yeah, I don't mind. I'm on my break. What is it that you need to talk to me about while you're doing your test?
Sure, there are many ways to getting rid of bullies and whatnot. The harder way to you doing it is using your words. Sometimes it won't work, but over time, it will. Or you could be physical about it, like every other kid was going through in high school and whatnot. A fight. Yeah, but that's the stupid route, and both of you would get in trouble. And plus, fighting with someone with a quirk is basically fighting a villain in a high school. So I'd advise not to do that one. I advise you get an adult next time it happens. Mm hmm. And if they are in one of our classrooms, we will have them settled and whatnot, or even expelled. If it's in my class, I will expel them. Okay, good, they're not. I wouldn't allow that type of... That type of, uh... You know what I'm trying to say here. Behavior. Thank you. I will not allow to have that type of behavior in my classroom. Or with my class students, my classmates and whatnot. Mm hmm. And you're just a second year. So I don't know why people are bullying on you when you were almost a third year. I know. It's really, really. something about it. It doesn't click with me right. Bullying someone because they're younger and weaker than you. I don't get it at all. But don't worry. If it happens again, you come to me or anyone else of the pro heroes, okay? All right. Hmm. A mission? With who? Hawks and Endeavor. They didn't talk to me about a mission. Well, where is this mission going to be put? Oh. All right, well. If that's going to be the case, then fine. You're going to have Hawks and Endeavor with you. I trust their words and their protectiveness. Hopefully. And I will leave it up to them. They're... Top of the top best of the heroes here, so I guess you can miss out on a few weeks or or so be how long you're over there with them. But I'm gonna have you write an essay of how the trip was, and I want it to be a hundred words exactly. All right, that sounds like a fair trait to me. Mm-hmm. Uh, well, when it comes to quirk training, um, I think we're going to have a few quirk training days. It's coming up soonish. So we can get rid of that done in this month, I hope. And then we have more training days as well out in the fields and then we have a plan to take you all out into the city so we can patrol and try to fight real criminals as well to get a real taste of the hero work mm -hmm. that should be all done within the month Right, right. Are there, uh, are there any more questions you need to ask me, or? All right. Yeah, just sit down, do your redo test, and I'll just be sitting right here. Just edit on my desk while you, before you're uh, 
Well, not before. Put it on my desk after you're done. All right. Thank you. Ah, oh, poor kid. Getting bullied in school. I've seen a few go through bullying myself. But I know you're strong. I know you can get through it. I believe in you.